We've got some uh, areas of areas of, that we're ready to, uh, that's already kind of prefab for that. Um, we just want to make sure, uh, you know, we're working with Chico Unified, has got some like, areas identified. So, yeah. How big of a project is this? I, mean, I assume a lot of people, a lot of students, may not even come back at all because maybe they're finding new rentals or, you know. Yeah, no, we're, I'm getting texts from kids that have already gone to Texas and had to start a new life. So we know we're going to lose some, but I think the key. If we can get it together quickly, then we'll have lose less. And I think if it's not just a hodgepodge of that, we can get it in a nice school looking setting. And again, this will be a temporary thing to we rebuild Paradise and Concow. Um, but um, you know, again, if we did it the government way only, that would be a two year project. So we're, we're really asking the Department of Ed and everybody to really step up and make it quick. So you hoping for the portables and all the resources to come from the government or from private donations or whatever you can get? We'll do whatever it takes. We'll do whatever it takes. I mean, I would love to see by January 1st 100 portables there. I mean, I know we can do it. It's just, you got to get the people I've, to do it. I've been shooting this from the beginning. And then you're hoping maybe Beyonce or Bruce Springsteen can maybe just send some money in to help too? I don't want money. I, I, I think, you know, we'll get money. I, I think the kids, all of us need to see people that, um, I have no skin in the game, and but they're loving people, and I, I know both those people are. And uh, I say that because I, I was really struggling like three or four days ago. I called Dave Gordon from Sac County. He brought a couple of people to be with me just to help, you know, guide me and calm me down, get me to bed early, well, 12, 30 or one. But um, and the kids really need those kids that got to go to the 49er game. They just want to just do some normal thing, except talk about the fire and. Uh, all that so I, I, I push that out really just because I'm all about the arts and I think kids are going to learn uh, come back to music and arts and uh, working out and all that good stuff so uh, why wait I don't want to wait four months and now have a fundraising concert I just want a concert the kids go to have fun and the teachers. And you got a little emotional up there too. I mean, this is hard for, for adults as well too, just in general here. Yeah, I mean, my 350 staff came yesterday, and they're my people, they're my, I love them, and um, they're all traumatized to know when There was a ton of hugs, so you're going to have a couple moments of breakdowns and all that, but that's because you care, and so it's hard. There's not one person that doesn't know somebody lost a home in this county, and there's usually people, we all know probably 10 or 12. Hey, Queen, I, so I want to say something. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I really want to thank the people of Sacramento. I worked here 25 years, and I've worked out a partnership because one of the things, uh, and Dave Gordon, if you guys want Dave Gordon to come follow up, we'd love to do that. But, um, so one of the things that happens is going to be this big rush of the kids coming back and everyone goes away. So we're going to partner with the schools in Costa Cordova, uh, Elk Grove, San Juan, and Center. To help support the kids and like every Monday a new school will come up from those areas like, like the principal and the student council all through the end of the year so the kids have been traumatized we want this not to be a one and done because we're going to deal with a lot of mental health issues and um, they've got those four superintendents from those districts to confirm in 10 minutes and so we'll work on a schedule where the schools from Sacramento will be adopted and help our kids. And it's a beautiful thing, and I really appreciate Dave and all the superintendents ready. And we'll work on the district, and we're really looking forward to SAC keep representing. Great. Okay, cool. I can. Uh, That's gonna be a good story. You know, Dave, don't you? Uh, I don't know if I do. Office? I can give you my card. Yeah, he's ready. We're ready for that. Yeah, we get the four superintendents. Yeah. And those two superintendents, Dave and I, and. Uh, because the kid, if we do one and done, like I'll do an assembly and they won't say we use the kids do something every day and yeah. bring mascots and all that good stuff. Yeah, that's awesome. Cool. Alright, thank tired. you. It's tiring, but you know, we, we gotta, yeah, it's hard. But not as hard as Sacramento. Yeah. Oh, where? I have a house in Carmel. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah like from? East Sac, Arden oh, area. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, no worries. You're a tiny man. Oh, no. Okay, so. Maybe. We just need to 